compétence. in art and craft teaching process. The reinforcement of the competence in art and craft teaching process. Because many teachers think that art and craft is made for a specific category of people, but the teacher is supposed to be the first and the best art and craft people. Like I used to say in all my video, I'm just an artist. But the more I was doing art, I went back to school because they taught me that you cannot teach art and craft in primary without knowing their programs. That's why I understood in, before 2018 that the French people were not doing art and craft. They were doing the agriculture and making of broom and they were calling it art and craft. So until the new curriculum appeared in 2018, then they understood really, really what is art and craft. So, we will start with the nursery. The nursery, you have eight teams, right? Eight teams. We name those teams. And you cannot come out, your most of your difficulty is how to come out with those things. Right? Mm -hmm. And ask people to come with plastic cover. Uh, uh, ask people to come with plastic cover so that they can know, for example, if the team is a school, right? How can the primary, the nursery child present your school? The single. You have a paper. You already draw that house. That child will only use plastic cover, then a bit of gold, and paste. And paste according to, let's say this is a school. So the child will only paste. The cover like this. One, two, three, four, five cover, and so on. And it is done. Because the most difficult part in nursery is to represent their eight teams through art. They don't know how to carry it through art. Isn't it, madam? So, the same is the next team is what? Remember, the team is to reinforce your competence in doing art. So if you have a house, this house is too small, but if it is a big house like this, they can paste, go through pasting. They will be in two teams. They will be working with cycling. Because recycling is already in French, in all the French and British school uh, But the children, since they cannot cut, they cannot do anything, they can only paste it. In Nazi, you have three domains in art and craft. Pasting, painting, and moving. We have done the moving part today. We are now on the pasting. So, the same thing with the body. The body, you have a test of it. If you have this body, You have a body like this. All the child has to do is paste the plastic cover. Right? The child himself will tell you that this is the body, this is the head, and this is the legs, and so on. You understand that you can easily carry out visual art or art and craft in your domain. Now we bring, we will draw something like this so that you can feel much uh, easily, um, I mean, few plastic cover. 
just some few cover, plastic cover. The plastic cover will be to cover the body. Since the team is the body, so the plastic cover will be there. The child will, and you will see the child will do it. You saw how the nurses children were walking in the neighbor. I was just telling them what to do and they were doing. And if you were there, you could have marked. Say, okay, this one I understood, this one is in the process to me. So this is how to and to represent the family is the same state. The same state. You take the head of somebody you place there, you take the head of a woman, you cut and you paste. The head of a child, then you draw this so that the child can easily just place the cover. Because the most important thing is, and in art and art, the child should be in the middle of his learning process. Let him be the actor. At least at 75%, the teacher is only there at 25%. So that's for the, the pasting. We have already seen the modeling. Now, painting. How can we do painting? Easily in the zoo. This is a hand. This hand can become a hand. In the domain where we are talking about domestic 